hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'll be showing you how to fix a collar onto a shirt dress or a shirt top anyone so if you would like to see that keep on watching but before we head right into it please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thumbs up this video and leave a comment you need that you can see that i've, I've sewn this my clothes and then i've i want to now attach my collar I'll uh, first of all get the length that we have here. So I'm going to pull my tape measurement here and then measure this our neck circumference out and know what we are working with. Okay, so what I am having here is what um 17.75. That's what I'm have I have here. So I'm going to keep this aside. So this is the material that I'm going to be using for this. This is what is remaining for me. And I don't want my, I don't want my, I don't want my color to be that much, the width to be much, do you get? So we are having 17 and a half. I'm going to fold this. What do I have here? I'm just going to use this like, this is four inches. That is very okay. I'm going to use the four inches. So what I'll be doing is that we have 17 and 17.75 as the length of our collar. I'll go ahead and add an extra two inches on both sides. So altogether, what I'm going to have is four inches. I'm going to add four inches to the collar. Do you understand? So the four inches plus 17.75 should give me 21.75 this this material is not enough so so i'll go ahead and measure out my four plus four inches plus 17.75 which is going to be 21.75 i'll just leave it at 22 inches at this side and then what i'll now do is to go ahead and cut this out i'll cut this out this way The next thing I'll be doing is to attach my interfacing to this, do you get, so that it's going to be structured enough. So this is where we are going to get, you see the way I folded this into two, yeah? So I'm going to get the center of this particular collar that we are doing. This is the center of the collar. I'll go ahead and give it a bit of a notch so that I'm going to know where it's going. I don't want to use any shock on this outfit because is white in color so it is from here that this center that i'm now going to mark out my uh, my actual around the neck um, the, um circumference and my next circumference is 17.75 remember so if you divide 17.75 i'm coming 17.75 i'm going to have 16 8.75 no it will be 8.875 so i'm going to keep my tape my my tape from 8.875 this is 8.75 then this is eight this line here is 8.875 just that one line before nine inches that is where I'm, that that is where i am going to keep my tape measurement so this is it i'll go ahead and mark this place you see i will also go ahead and mark my 17.75 at this point at this junction also so now that i've marked it you can see i've marked it i'm using white shock so that I don't want any color to show. I've marked it at this point. I will now go to my table, my sewing machine, and then I'm going to join from here. I will, I'm going to sew from here diagonally to the end here. Do you understand? I'm going to sew it from here to the end here. I will also go ahead and do the same for here, for here, from here to the end here. So as you can see, guys, I've gone ahead. Let me cut out this thread here. I've gone ahead to sew this. You can see from here to here. You can see how I've done it. So I'll now go ahead and cut out this excess fabric that is at this point. I will also do the same for the other side of it. Cut out the excess fabric. So now we have cut it out. Can you see the way our ends are looking? Yeah, so what I'll now do next now is to go ahead and turn this to the front and use a sharp point. You have to get a sharp pointed something so that you can comfortably bring out the ends of this collar but be careful so that you don't puncture through it do you understand yeah i'm going to take my time and iron it out so the next thing i'll be doing now is to fold this place this our end by 050 like the way you do bias do you understand so i'm going to fold it boy as i did the 050 i'm going to make sure that 
both sides they are equal do you understand so i'm going to fold it by 050 and then press give it a good pressing whilst i am doing that so the next thing we are going to do is to get our shirts back now we are going to get the round the next side and then we are going to fix this to this outfit i am going to get the end of this top and coincide it with the end of this one do you get and then i am going to pin it up nicely so this is how you are going to do gradually fix it in until you reach the end a so guys i have successfully attached this color can you see the way it's, it's looking please if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up like this video and then i'll see you guys in my next one